Welcome back traders to Stadways' channel. My name is Ali Casey. This is the second video in a two-part series about multi-bar pattern tool. If you uh, didn't watch uh, part one, there should be a link uh, up in the corner or down in the comments. Please uh, go and watch it. And if you already did, then welcome back. And let's continue using this tool and see what we can do with it. The methodology is very simple. Now I'm gonna add three bar. So go to random conditions. And now we will add the three day close. And for four bars, we will add the four day close. So now for four days, which is for comparison, this is not four days, this is five days and we're comparing we four. So we should get 16 combinations. So let's save this as uh, four bar close. Remember, we're only comparing close to close. And let's go to Builder, clear all this, and let's pick the template. And now we should have 16 combinations. And let's do the data again. Let's go back to end of 2017. December and no out of sample and we should have 16 combinations great we already got the 16 this doesn't matter anymore and now let's look at the bar so this looks amazing and what bar is this what configuration this is zero zero this is all zeros again it proves the theory that the ES is mean reverting and it's always good to go long after a down day. And second best, 0, 0, 1, 1. And then third best, 0, 1, 1, 0. And then last one, 0, 0, 0, 1. And obviously, this is going the, uh, the closest to the furthest. So the first bar is the closest. We're comparing today with yesterday. So you can see in all of these guys, this is down, this is zero. So this one is zero, and this one zero, and this one zero, and this one is zero. So all of them, all these good patterns, end with today is down, so we can go long tomorrow. And now we can uh, compare all these again with the uh, out of sample. So we can reset, and now we can pick the out of sample to 2017 December. And it's the same, and we should have a new 16. So let's stop it. So this pattern, which was doing well, it's triple zero one and let's try to find it I think it's this one triple zero one yes so out of sample is bad actually we can easily find that uh, this is the only good out of sample and this one ends in up today so the last bar is up is doing well since 2013 so again, this is very good strategy. Look, let's keep doing higher highs. And this is without even adding a filter. And of course, remember, we're only going long. So of course, you can build the same on the short side. And most likely, these guys, or well, this one, most likely it will do well on the short side. And same with the short side, you can add a... Uh, a market filter like the SMA or like the Kaufman efficiency ratio and you can add it also on the short side and they don't have to match so don't get into this matching uh, actually I would rather much rather that you guys build a separate short strategy than the long strategy don't combine them into one there is no reason that the entry for long should be symmetrical for short especially in futures maybe you're used to this in uh, the currency market which I agree, if it's long term, 
then most likely it should work on multiple markets and most likely it should be symmetrical because on short term the volatility is so much different on the short side than the long side so always build separately the short and the long like i told you this tool cost you know 400 500 dollars in other platforms that you can buy it to customize and we can ju we just try to scratch the surface with this tool there are so many combinations you can do like adding uh, for example the random combination that com compares the open so right now we're comparing only close to close and you can com compare the close to the open and remember i showed you this in the beginning so this is comparing close to op to to the open of the same bar and of course you can build comparing the close to the open of the previous bar or comparing the high to the high of the previous bar so there are many combinations you can build and add this alone will add probably i don't know 300 400 uh, blocks uh, to the builder but remember with this download i gave you two simple one which are these so you can actually do this let's let's do this now so let's clear all this and let's go to builder and we're gonna build a uh, simple strategy and trading blocks and uh, and building blocks we will exit let's exit after uh, Let's make it the same after three bars. Just to give you some examples. And now I will pick. So these guys and let's pick Stat Oasis. So it's these two. So these two patterns are these guys so uptrend pull back downtrend pull back and so we only added now Kaufman and let's see well now we want to build a did we decide on the long side entry so exit is one because we have only okay so let's clear all this so we have 766 and let's see something that's good on both this looks good this also looks good so this one uses the block and the Kaufman which is the, the only one we picked looks nice remember the equity alone does not represent your <laughs> profitable uh, opportunity because you're gonna put this in a portfolio even even if you're trading only the ES I like I keep drilling this back but even if you're trading only the ES you should trade it in a portfolio like you should put five strategies trading the ES so you see the potential is huge I hope you can use it to make some strategies that's gonna make money Remember, for robust strategies on patterns, you only need a significant amount of uh, trades. Like there is no walk forward analysis to do or SPP. Uh, you can do Monte Carlo testing to find out the amount of money that you, you want to start with. But there is no optimization here. It's either the pattern works or it doesn't work. You can, the only thing you're gonna probably optimize, probably, which is the market filter, the market regime. And if you go to an SMA, it should be, you know, 50, 100, 200. And if you're going with RSI, it should be 2, 10, 20, like this. Like you don't need to perform really detailed uh, optimization because then it's like curve fitting. Uh, so obviously remember simple is better try with the pattern alone and and add a a market filter and if it's there is a significant enhancement then okay otherwise don't use it
And remember to read the ebook to fill out the gaps that I probably I didn't go over in the video. And if you have any questions, put it down in the comments. I'll be happy to answer them. Great, you made it to the end of the video. Thank you for watching. Please do share, like, subscribe so Google can push it to other traders. And if you have any questions, comment below and I'll be happy to answer them. Until the next video, stay safe and I'll see you soon.